Hello, 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 everybody. This is the Caped Avenger once again, here to warmly welcome you to another episode of Dawn Somewhere Discoveries. Uh, I believe we're on 9 now, maybe? And, uh, as you may have noticed, we are not in our normal starting position. Uh, I'm actually beginning this episode from the uh, warm comfort of the Drunken Miller Inn, I believe it's called. Yep. Uh, this is in Binlal City. Uh, it has yet to be named. That's, uh, somebody should probably get on that. And, uh, I, I've taken up residency in here while I'm, uh, away from home. As you can see, there are a few chickens in here just to make me f feel right at home. Uh, I've been a little inactive for the last week. I apologize. I've just been taking a break. A lot of work to catch up on. Uh, school and, uh, we're home and whatnot. But, uh, it's business as usual, starting today, and, uh, I wish the sun weren't setting, because I have a few pretty cool things to show you today, but, uh, I think we can make do. Incidentally. That's nice. So. Uh, since you've last seen it, this, uh, this little town here has, uh, received a few embellishments. Uh, most noticeably, the giant pyramid that is currently in construction, uh, right next to it, uh, possibly overlapping some of it. It's really, uh, it really catches your eye. It's, it's quite a landmark. Can't really get lost, can you? Just spot the giant pyramid. Uh, that, I believe, is a project of McNally's. Uh, something to do with the Doom Fortress. Ow. I'm not too sure, but uh, apparently we're just going to have to live and let live. Uh, I don't mind so much. It provides this town with a sense of security, I think, having a giant monolith standing over it. Uh, as you can see, Binlaw's castle. He's uh, built it up from the ground. It's very nice looking. Some battlements here. Let's take a look. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Mm, that's unfortunate. I've been there. But, uh, and you can get sort of a nice view. You can see the rest of the city through the trees. It's a pity the, uh, the monorail is, is so visible. I, I rather wish it weren't there. I think it somewhat detracts from the, ow, from the, uh, aesthetic of the town. But, oh, well, you gotta do what you gotta do to get around. That's technology for you. So if we can proceed down this path without getting killed, you'll see my little marketplace over there. Uh, I, I, as you might be able to tell, I haven't made too much progression on my, uh, on my. Oh, it's raining! Fantastic, on my uh, little village, I guess. Um, forgetting the word, but uh, on my little plot of land that has been bequeathed to me by Binlol. But uh, what I have done is built myself a trading ship. Ooh, visibility is uh, rather low at the moment, but uh, I think we can go in for a closer look. Nice little dock. And uh, it's a little difficult to make out, but as you can see, it's pretty simple. Nice uh, flat, low to the water ship, good surface tension. Uh, nice little flags I designed. I'm rather happy with that. Originally, I was planning on having square flags, but uh, they looked a little silly when I realized that 6x6 six six took up about a third of that height. So I decided just to go whole hog, made use of the communal sheep farm, and uh, I think it's a nice little trading vessel. Uh, nothing's inside it at the moment. Uh, here, how about we just take a look-see? My favorite method of getting around buckets should probably light it up, but uh, as you can see, rather simple. But I, I like the way it looks. I think it, uh, I think it kind of rounds out the f authenticity of the of the uh, whole trading post feel. So let's hop back in our boat. Uh, that's really what I've been working on. You know, just uh, taking a little break from from the sewers to uh, get some fresh air. Don't you know? I mean, I'm a pirate, for God's sake. 
Can't stay cooped up all day. Gotta sail the seas, don't you know? But, uh, I am planning on doing something with this plot of land. Uh, my space is a little bit restricted now that, uh, there's an altar of death being built around the... over the hill. But, uh, I, I think I can still do something nice. I'm not sure exactly what I have in mind, but, uh, ideas are flowing, my dear friends. Ideas are flowing. Uh, there... huh. Shoot, there used to be a nice little lava fall down this hill, but I guess it was cleared out. Oh, here, this is actually a rather nice view. Take a look at this. Isn't that cool? Oh, ow. But, uh... Oh, right, I forgot I stepped in here. Before I started recording. But someone with a lot of time on their hands has just... I don't even know, it's like a giant pizza cutter slicing through the earth uh, what do you want from me I'm no poet I'm a pirate not a poet and uh, I'm just gonna hope none of my stuff went down there cuz not going down for a second look but uh, yes there used to be a nice little lava fall flowing down here and I'm, I'm sad it had to go I could probably make another one but I expect it was cleaned up for a reason I would hate to interfere with this, uh, most large scale of projects. Yeah. Yeah, somebody's lit up this cave. Ah, oh, well. But uh, I guess I'll take this opportunity to, uh, climb to the top of a mountain and get a better look. Because, uh, I think... I think just getting a nice little overview of the village will be nice. Uh, as for my plans in terms of... Oh, that's not a good hole to fall down. <gasps> In terms of my plans uh, for my allegiance with Bin Lal, uh, we haven't had a chance to chat very much. Uh, I'm just going to accept his generous offering of land, uh, do a little building, and we'll get together at some point. Uh, at the moment, we haven't declared war on anyone quite yet. Ow! Which uh, is rather to my advantage, because I'd like to get a little more established before I start declaring wars. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love fighting wars. I love murdering people and bathing in the blood of my enemies. Uh, how does the quote go? The most, what is the most wonderful thing in life? To bathe in the blood of your enemies and to hear the lamentation of the women. Something to that effect. Mm, Conan the Barbarian. Good movie. Just kidding. Terrible movie. But uh, in any case... I think... I may have lost my train of thought there. Right, wars. I think that uh, I would like to get a little better established before I go murdering people. Uh, and then once the murder does start, I think I'm going to have a lot of fun. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, all my videos thus far have been building up to my first murder. Uh, as you might have heard in my last video, I mentioned to Bin Lol I was planning on starting up a bounty hunting service. If I'm completely honest, that is the... Uh, the thing I had planned for my little house under the sewers, but, um, didn't work out because, as I told Bin Lol, uh, I did some asking around and people in general seemed, uh, divided as to whether or not they'd like to, uh, open up the possibility of being killed at any moment while they're working, which I suppose I can sympathize with, but, uh, it makes my job as a bounty hunter rather difficult if I could uh, be kicked from the server for murdering the wrong person. So for now, I think I'm going to play it safe, keep my head down, keep my nose clean, and then uh, when war is destro uh, excuse me, when war is declared, you will see my true face, my true murderous, hideous, animalistic face. Uh, but with all that said, I think. Uh I think now that I've built my ship, I'm going to start with some buildings here. Maybe, I don't know, I guess this is a little trading port town, so maybe some, uh, a marketplace? That'd be nice. I mean, the, the ground is slanted and uneven, which, uh, may be a problem, but if... Actually, this is an idea that's just occurring to me, but I suppose I could build a marketplace on that little sandbar there. I cleared out a bit of it to, uh, ow! To, uh, make my port look less claustrophobic, but there's still a nice little beach there that I could, uh, that I could, uh, commandeer. So, I think that's a good idea. I may just do that. 
so, yes, I suppose this video has just been to put out some of my thoughts about where to go from here and to keep you updated on the state of things. Uh, not much has changed back home. I've, uh, as I said, I've been getting a little fresh air out here. Uh, I've been doing some fishing as well. I've taken to fishing. I've rather taken to fishing. Uh, I find it's a relaxing pastime, especially when you're using your rod to beat down a poisonous spider. Nothing more relaxing in the world. Ow. Especially when the spider's winning. That's unfortunate. But, uh, I think you... There we go. I think you get the idea. Ah, a little too late. Ah, well, we'll continue later. So, uh, I think that about does it for now. I'm gonna head back in here. Eat some rotten flesh. Mmm, good for the body and the mind. And, uh... On that note, I think I may now bid you all farewell. See you next time, guys.